Guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to add video, music, and images for offline playback straight from your Wear OS smartwatch without needing your phone for any Wear OS smartwatch like the TicWatch Pro 3, TicWatch E3, Fossil Gen 5, etc. for free even when paired with an iPhone. As you're watching with Stu and if it's your first time here, thank you so much for clicking. Here is our review smartwatches, smartphone, headphones, etc. So if you're into all that kind of stuff, you must consider subscribing. Alright, so for this video, I'll be using my TicWatch E3, which is paired with my iPhone 12 mini. But anything that I will show in this video will work for any Wear OS smartwatch that has a built-in Wi-Fi, built-in storage, and a built-in speaker when paired with any Android smartphone or an iPhone. So, first of all, to speed things up, go under Settings, Connectivity, Wi-Fi, and make sure your watch is connected to a Wi-Fi network. Now, if you prefer to keep the Wi-Fi turned off to save battery life, that's fine. You can certainly come back here and do that after we are done with the transfers. Now, a while back I did a video on how to transfer music files to your Wear OS smartwatch via Google Play Music and the video is linked at the end of this video in case if you are curious to know how Google Play Music worked and looked like. But in December of 2020, Google stopped Google Play Music and started YouTube Music. However, they did not add YouTube Music app to Wear OS smartwatches like the Google Play Music, which was uncanny and left a lot of users, including me, in a limbo. Well, now there are few paid and free file explorer apps that can sort of do that. And that's what I'm going to show you guys in this video. So for this video, I have used two apps. The first one is Sun Player, which is a music as well as a video player that is available for free from the Google Play Store irrespective to the smartphone that your watch is paired with. I have linked the direct download link to this Sun Player in the video description. Another app that I have used to transfer music, video and image files from my PC to this Wear OS smartwatch is the File Manager. Again, it's free and the direct download link to this app is linked in the video description. Now, if your watch is paired to an Android phone, then you can transfer directly from your phone. But since my TicWatch E3 is paired with my iPhone 12 mini, I'll show you guys this step from a computer. By the way, guys, this video is not sponsored at all. So with this both needed app being installed, let's open up the file manager. Once you open it up the file manager, you'll be greeted with this menu where the first two options are to access files and folders on your watch. The third option is for background processes, which you can force stop if you need to in case if any app is not functioning properly. But I would advise you to refrain from messing around here if you don't know what you're doing. In the second row, the first two options are to transfer files to your watch. The second one is to transfer files via your Android phone directly over Bluetooth. But since my watch is paired to an iPhone, this option is of no use. So then the first option is to transfer files via a computer by FTP that is file transfer protocol over a Wi-Fi network, which is super fast. Now, before I show you the transfer process, the rest of the options are user apps, free up some space, download folder, images. Here's where you can see all the images on the watch in the respective folder. You can double tap to zoom and use your finger to move around on the image. You can also click on the top right button to either delete or share this image. Going back, the same goes for the videos, where you can see all the video files on your watch in their respective folders. Now, during a video playback, you can slide up or down on the right hand side of the screen to adjust the volume. You can tap on the video to get options like lock, subtitles, play or pause, screen rotate under more options you'll find sleep trimer playback speed jump to time equalizer play as an audio resize repeat mode video information repeat and save to the playlist pretty much this app is like a music or a video player so technically you don't need the sun player 
Finally, going back, you have the music option to see the music files on your watch in the respective folder. Now, once you start a music playback, you cannot do anything from this app. The music will play in the background no matter what you do. So you have to slide down to access quick settings menu where you will find the music player, player bar. And here is where you can stop the playback. Now this is why I think you need a sun player. Now let me briefly show you the whole transfer process. So let's go in the file manager. Now select transfer option from PC to your watch. This will prompt that web server is not running and the storage path. Also you can select start to get the link which you can then type in on your computer's web browser. You can also use this link from your mobile phone web browser. Now a very important key point is that your PC, phone and the watch all must be connected to the same Wi-Fi network in order for the transfer process to happen. If they are not, then you will get an error message. So make sure all the devices are connected to the same Wi-Fi network, especially the 2.4 GHz network as the watch does not support a 5 GHz Wi-Fi connection. Now let's go ahead and type the link in the web browser of my PC. This will open up the file transfer interface. Here is where you can see all the folders and files on your watch. This is pretty cool, huh? Now, you should see the upload option on the top right. Click it to get the option to select files. After which you can just go and select the files from your PC. Preferable file format will be JPEG for images, MP3 for music and MP4 for videos. Now once you have selected, just hit upload and that is it. The file will be uploaded instantly onto your watch. The only caveat is that you cannot select multiple files which would be really nice. Now once the files are successfully transferred, you can close the web browser. From the file manager app on your watch, you can stop the file transfer protocol. And now you can either view the transferred file via the file manager on your watch. But since we have downloaded the Sun Player, let's go ahead and open up the Sun Player. Once you open up the Sun Player, you'll find few options on the top panel. The first one is to switch from video to music or your created playlist. Let's go ahead and select audio. Now you can either search from the top panel and beside the search button, there will be an option to resume, playback, sort by, display in list and refresh. Under the top panel, you get to select from artist, albums, tracks and genre. The cool part is the tracks are alphabetically organized. Now, once you play a music track, you get the music player options which includes skip a track forward or backward, play or pause, and repeat options. From the top right menu option, you will get options like information, add to playlist, remove, stop, after this, and share. So if you have transferred a lot of music files, you can even create your own playlist. So all these options were not available for music playback via the file manager app on the watch that we talked earlier. And that is why I prefer to use this sun player. Now let's go back and select video. Now once you start a video playback, you'll get pretty much all the same options as I showed you earlier in the file manager app on your watch. So there you go, this is how you transfer images, music and video files for free from your phone or PC to your Wear OS smartwatch and this above method will work for any Wear OS smartwatch. Guys, if you find value in this video, please make sure to hit that like button and the subscribe button so you don't miss out such helpful videos and also share it to your friends and family so this video can help out others. With that said, thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, check these videos out as you may find them enticing.